finally, we got some Golf LaFleur information. Uh, it's from like a super secret squirrel. Agent Triple Zero, secret squirrel reporting for duty. Well, like meeting going down in uh, California, most likely. Uh, looks like it was a pop-up shop, I believe. his close friends and things like that. A lot of this information I got from just following some of the people he followed, which is, that's creepy as hell. But hey, we gotta get the news, all right? I gotta bring y'all a scoop, you know what I'm saying? This is why I do this. Uh, so it looks like it's gonna be a pop-up shop. Now we do got a few items. Now, what did I say last video about trucks? Uh, I think it's like I'm super excited for them. Well, we got trucks. All right, uh, we got multiple ones. I, I, I only saw two or three, but the one that they really showed in detail, it's gonna have, uh, it's gonna be made from vulcanized uh, fiberboard, which is super strong, super flexible, uh, super reinforced. It's gonna have leather handles, uh, leather accents, it's gonna have pastel accents as well. On the inside, it's gonna have that leopard, uh, kind of digital leopard print uh, that uh, Cap Tyler creator's been rocking. Shoot, you call him Tyler Baudelaire. Or should I say Sir Baudelaire? It's been rocking in uh, the like, what's your name and all the other stuff like that. It kind of reminds me back when I was in the Marine Corps, our Marpat design. It's kind of that digital Marpat. So that's gonna be on the inside of the trunk. Now, if you guys are fans of Goyard, stuff like that, you guys should already know premium trunk prices. Uh, this is going for like $13.95. No! No! $1,400 USD, you know what I'm saying? So I'm gonna try to get my hands on one. We'll see. I right, try. Now, the next thing uh, that I want to get off into that I was excited about was the Ushankas. Uh, now, they were kind of on a shelf, kind of tucked up to the left next to like this kind of chibi looking thing. Uh, and they didn't have a price on them, but we do see, I think it's the white and the baby blue. I personally want that brown. Maybe that baby blue, that brown and that baby blue. Those are pretty much the only ones. I, I did see a black one though that he wore in that picture with rain. So I think I might want that too. I got a, I got I got an outfit in mind with the dark slates with that. But uh, so we got the Ushankas. No price or no information like that. But I'm gonna assume around that's actual, you know, for maybe about 200 bucks, 150. Uh, we did get some shirt designs that we saw. Most of them come in like these little bar uh, stripe designs on the shirt. Uh, no idea what material. So it looks like it's gonna be 100% cotton, but I could be wrong. I don't see anything that makes me think it's gonna be made from mohair or anything like that. Um, what else did we see? Now, unfortunately, we didn't see what I was looking forward to was the kind of, uh, it's either gonna be rayon or silk uh, kind of shirt with the digital uh, leopard print all over. I'm looking forward to that. Um, I did see the ascot. We got two ascot colors. I saw, I think it's like pink and yellow or red and yellow, and we got a brown. Which is the one I'm interested in. Max is butter brown skin tone, you know what I'm saying? Max all this brown, you know what I'm saying? Uh, I look forward to that. Uh, another thing I'm excited for now, if you guys didn't know, I'm a fragrance man, uh, especially it's in Yake, we talking to your Sauvage. Uh, and these are niche fragrances. Those aren't even house fragrances, but uh, so yeah, we got some French Waltz uh, information. Like if you guys got some stuff from the Summer Drop, possibly you got uh, French Waltz samples. I got two. Uh, from the look of it though, in this store, there's gonna be multiple kinds. Now, he's likely not gonna do an all fresh for, which is like the weakest 
of uh, fragrances. He's likely gonna do an EDT, which is your Eau de Toilette, and he's likely gonna do, do an uh, EDP, which is an Eau de Parfum. And they're basically the same thing. One just uh, has a higher concentration, so it's gonna have a, a stronger smell, and obviously it's gonna be uh, more expensive. So, uh, first waltz, I believe, that we got in the mail with the uh, Summer Drop was an EDT Eau de Toilette. So that's like right before your EDP, your Eau de Parfum, or actually, I take that back. That's right before your uh, EDC, your Eau de Cologne. So I'm excited about that. Most likely for about 100 milliliters, it's gonna run about $125 most likely. Uh, just because some of these designer fragrances try to get out of pocket with that shit. Um, what else did we see? We saw Passport. Looks like that's gonna be all leather, super dope for that. Uh, we got fucking some glasses. I'm not really a glasses guy. Uh, what else do we see in there, guys? A pick for my hairstyle, uh, hairstyle guys. Uh, some nail polish. I know a lot of you guys and gals and whatever uh, else, if you know you guys identify as, are looking forward to that nail polish. So that's gonna be super dope for some of you. Now I didn't see really any color, but obviously we're talking we're talking Tyler here. It's gonna come in multiple colors anyway, man. Now I believe this was just a pop up shop for like his close friends or something like that, and like only the people who were in the know knew about it. I didn't know about it. I'm, one day I'm gonna get there, okay? Ah! It should have been me, not him. It's not fair. I'm gonna get there one day, hopefully. Um, but yeah, guys. So we didn't get any release information yet. Uh, there's still various things we don't know about. We didn't see anything really on the cardigans. I don't think uh, I'm gonna run through and make sure, but I don't think we saw any information or anything on the cardigans. We didn't see uh, a lot of the Ushanka colors. I only had two. Uh, we saw trunks, we saw fragrances, uh, so we, we got a lot to look forward to. Uh, save your money, guys. Save it up, save it up now. Just now that we saw some solid stuff, save it up now. They've uh, changed the profile pic on Instagram, they got verified. I'd say definitely by February it's coming, which is gonna suck for me because I got the Safari package for fucking the Call Me If You got, Get Lost tour, and I'm trying to grab one of those like one in 150 jack tour jackets too, bro. So my pockets are gonna be hurting, guys and gals, but I'm doing it for y'all, okay? Uh, we got that Golf LaFleur, Golf LaFleur, that Golf Wing uh, tryout video coming. I'm just waiting for my brown pants. I already got the green pants on. If you guys are following my Instagram or you see me in the radio, you guys are mostly already see me uh, my fit with the green pants. So we're just waiting for the brown pants to get here. We're gonna drop that. I've got multiple Giano videos on my pocket, guys, multiple. I'm waiting for the last video to hit 200, then I'll drop the Parfait Pink video. Once I pop that video and that gets 200, I'm gonna drop the freaking uh, the Evergreen video, all right? So I'm ready to go. I got content rolling out for you guys. I appreciate you guys rocking out for me or rocking out with me. I got those videos coming. Like I said, this is unscripted. I like, I could have like super edited it and like super studied some shit that I didn't. Okay, whatever, it is what it is, all right? All right, that's like the end of the video. That's it, I don't got nothing to say. Let's go. go home or some shit, I don't know.